So before we start working in Figma or any other design tool, the first and very important thing is to conceptualize your design on paper using pencil. Drawing on paper is a lot more easier and faster as compared to computer. Also, our mind is trained to use paper and pencil. When you are using paper and pencil, a lot of interesting ideas will come to your mind and uh, you can easily put those ideas uh, on paper. During a design on paper, also known as, known as wireframe, uh, will improve your design skill a lot and uh, you will able to create unique designs as well. So as you can see here, I have uh, created a draft for the landing page that I'm going to design. And uh, this draft include uh, uh, some of the commonly used uh, uh, sections in the design, which is a uh, header, uh, features grid, cards grid, content section, testimonials, and then we have some uh, um, clients or uh, you know social proof and then we have uh, a call to action and then finally we have footer these are some commonly used uh, elements in the design uh, here are like uh, 90 to 95 percent uh, uh, you know sections that are used in uh, every landing page uh, remember these are 90 to 95 percent not all of them uh, there might be a few more but mostly these are the things that are these are the sections that are used in in a design so we have a header we have a social proof below fold area sometimes we use about us Sometimes, depending upon the requirement, uh, we we can have how it works section. Then we have value props like we have here. Then we have cards grid like we have here. Then we can have stats content section like we have here. And uh, then uh, some pages can have pricing and FAQs and team members. Uh, in some pages, we can also put recent blog post and we can have testimonials like we have here. Then we have call to action and the footer like we have here. Remember, we don't have to put all of these section in single landing page or, or the home page. Uh, that can depend. We can pick and choose uh, what will work best for one specific landing page. So uh, this is a kind of a basic draft that uh, I have uh, created and uh, this is what we are going to now work on. Now as you can see here the uh, the importance of creating a wireframe or draft before we start working directly on the design tool. This gives you a, di uh, a guideline basically uh, like how your page should look like and uh, what contents or what sections it should include. So now you don't have to worry about the structure or you don't have to remember the structure because you have that on the paper and uh, you can now simply go ahead and uh, make it look better that's your job now your job is not to think about what to put in this uh, content but uh, now your job is just to make it look better and nice uh, instead of uh, thinking that uh, uh, what should go where and uh, what we should be uh, what we should be having on this landing page so this is i hope uh, you understand the importance of creating a rough draft before you start implementing in the figma and uh, or any other design tools and one more uh, you know helpful thing when you are creating a draft like this uh, in your paper you can get this uh, approved from your client uh, because uh, you can just uh, tell the client like uh, this is what i have in the mind for the sections and uh, 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 the client will also be focused on the structure of the page instead of the design uh, in the first phase. And uh, if uh, the uh, layout is approved, if the, the structure of the design is approved, then it becomes really easy to get the design approved as well because now uh, they don't have any objection on the layout of the page, but they will if they will have any feedback, that feedback, feedback will be about either the color scheme or uh, sometimes the color scheme is also provided by the client so they might have some feedback about the font or uh, the spacing or so these will be the minor feedbacks as compared to you know you submit something to the client and uh, they totally reject it as they don't like the structure so in this way the structure is already approved and uh, it will be really easy for you to get the design approved from client as well